Hey what's up guys welcome back to another after video tutorial in today's tutorial i will show you how to connect dots so let's get started okay guys i'm gonna start with a new comp and let's go with these connected dots now we go with the default setting and hit ok let's go with toolbar and select the ellipse tool without any stroke and i will disable the stroke and i will go with a uh, black fill if you guys want different color you can choose and i will go with black for this tutorial and let's just hold shift and draw a uh, ellipse like that and i'm gonna press ctrl o at home on my keyboard to reset the anchor point as you can see and let's rename this to dots so i'm gonna select this and press enter to rename this dot left okay i need two more so i'm gonna duplicate this so select this and press ctrl d to duplicate and i will select the selection tool and i will move it around the composition here okay duplicate once more select this and press ctrl d to duplicate once again and i will drag this here and we have three dots now we need our line so i'm gonna just add a line so let's go to toolbar and select the pen tool and here we don't need any fill so i'm gonna just disable the fill and i will go ahead and enable the stroke and i will go with black one 24 pixel i will just draw a line like that this will be our press line and let's go with this line and let's draw two more so i'm gonna just draw another line this will be our line two let's draw one more like that okay this will be our line three okay perfect now i'm gonna select this line three and hold shift and click on this below line and let's go to search bar and search for path this will give us all the path layers so i'm gonna just select this path hold control and then you can select all of these path layer at the same time okay now you can go to windows now let's select this create null from path script this will open this script select this point follow null this will create a null for each of these path points okay now if you select the selection tool let me show you as you can see now these lines follow these nulls now i will just place these nulls like this so you can clearly see these nulls like that okay now we need to parent these null layers to these dots so i'm gonna just pull all of these layers now i will select this null layer and then hold shift and i will click this null layer again so now we selected both of these layers now i'm gonna just parent this to this first dot if you don't see this parent one you can right click go to columns and find this parent and link i'm gonna hold shift on my keyboard and just pick pip this to the first dot as you can see it will snap to this dot now if you press the dot and just move it around the composition and as you can see all of these nulls follow the first dot now we need to parent this two null to this dot so i'm gonna just select this and hold shift on my keyboard and click this this will both selected and i'm gonna just hold shift on my keyboard once again and just pick up this to dot two as you can see i will do this to this dot so i will just fast forward this step as you can see now if you check these dots all of these lines connected to this uh, dots as you can see now i'm gonna just select all of these dots and press p to bring the other position screen let's add a wiggle expression for this position and i'm gonna just hold alt and click on this stopwatch icon of the position and let's type this wiggle expression if you press the space bar now our dot is moving i will give it 100 yeah okay now i will just select this position and right click copy this expression and now let's go to position and press ctrl v to paste the expression just like that okay now as you can see it's super easy to connect the dots in after it. and this is the better way than the using beam effect and also you can just individually apply the trim path to these lines as you can see this way you can just animate the path if you go to one second and i will create a keyframe for the end let's go a few frames forward and just increase the end to 100 and as you can see now that line is animated and this method is really flexible and that's basically how you connect the dots in after bit and i hope you guys learned something new also shout out to all of my Patreon supporters and i will see you guys in the next one peace